Sorry.com, and we're standing in front of the booth where the new president will watch the ceremonies. And as you can see, we're surrounded by, you name it, and they're here. These are the guys who are working on the uh, booth where the president will sit. And as you can see, this thing is like, ain't no bombs coming up in there, buddy. <laughs> and I'm kidding about that. But this thing is secure. That is bulletproof, bombproof, black glass. Now on the other side of the street, this is, uh, I don't know who's, I guess this is the congressman and senator sit over here. That's a two-tier, and it's made out of steel. But this is what it looks like, and the parade is going to come from that direction, straight ahead. So I don't know where it ends, where it ends up from there. But this is what it's going to look like, and we're getting a first-hand view of what you will see in about four days from there, five days from there. This is what it looks like. This is Washington, D.C. It's cold out here. My nose is running. It's about 22 degrees out here. But I'm going to walk you down to where the parade will come from, the direction that the parade will come from. In fact, you can look through here and see the White House. I'm going to pull you in close as I can get you. There's the White House. And there's the booth where the President will sit to watch the parade and ceremonies after he's sworn in. Mike, can you see the White House? So this is it. And this is the security. That's the Metropolitan and that's the Park Police, I think. And this is part of the um, the breaches that will accommodate. I think you have to pay to sit in these breaches. But this is what it's going to look like for the president and his family in about four days. This is RadioDiary.com.